I'm Adadiah Perkovich, reporting for the Scholastic News Kids Press Corps. Was the adaptation process with, uh, for Wonderstruck different uh, from the process of Hugo Cabret? Well, for me, the main difference is that I got to write the screenplay for mm -hmm. Wonderstruck. With uh, the invention of Hugo Cabret, I gave my book to Martin Scorsese, the director, and his team, and I got to visit the set once, which was really fun, mm -hmm. but I didn't get to really know what they were doing until I saw the movie. You know, like visiting mm -hmm. the set, I saw you know how beautiful it was, mm -hmm. and I saw how great the actors were, and I saw how incredible all the props were and the costumes. Mm -hmm. Uh, but it really wasn't until I saw the movie that I understood what they were doing and the fact that they really kept it very faithful to mm -hmm. the, uh, the the book that I had written, some mm -hmm. changes. Yeah. But I had I wasn't really a part of it. With Wonderstruck, because I wrote the screenplay, mm -hmm. I was a part of it from the very, very beginning. Yeah. So I made a lot of decisions when I was writing the screenplay that mm -hmm. the director, Todd Haynes, really liked, that he mm -hmm. used in the movie. Yeah. Uh, and then I got to see all of the different departments as they were making everything, yeah. just like you did. Yeah. And so I got to see the costumes as they were being made and the sets and, and uh, all the props being collected, which yeah. was really cool. And then I was on set almost every day that they were filming. So okay. I got to see almost every shot. <laughs> yeah. And so that was really, really fun. But once the filming began, I really stepped back because yeah. it's my story and it's my screenplay and it was my book. But it's really Todd Haynes' movie. It's really mm -hmm. the director's movie. And I didn't want him to feel like I was like looking over his shoulder and like <laughs> yeah. judging him or making, you know, being upset about anything. Mm -hmm. I wanted him to know that I respected him mm -hmm. and I, and that and that I trusted him and that it was his. Yeah. And so I would sneak on, you know, at the <laughs> and, you know, in the morning I would like very quietly sit in the back of the chairs where yeah. people were watching things. And uh, you know, if he saw me, he said hi. Mm -hmm. And there were one or two times during the filming when he asked me a question mm -hmm. uh, to help with something. But mostly, mm -hmm. I was just there to observe. So mm -hmm. it was it was a pretty different experience than Hugo. Mm -hmm. But the the level of artistry that went into making the movie was the same as yeah. Hugo. And I'm as proud of this movie as I was of Hugo. Yeah.